Google Analytics can be overwhelming. It gives you a huge amount of data and then it gives you endless ways to look at that data. So I'm going to show you an easy way to get started with Google Analytics and start getting value out of it by setting up a dashboard. A dashboard gives you a quick customized snapshot of your website's metrics. It's really easy to add new ones. I'm tracking multiple websites, so I'm going to pick the one I want to add a new dashboard to. Now, make sure that you're in the reporting section and then go to dashboards and it's in the upper left hand corner of the screen and then you want to click new dashboard. So here you've got options. You can start with a blank canvas, a starter dashboard that has some widgets in it, or you can choose import from gallery. And that's what I would recommend that you do. It's an easy way to get detailed metrics without having to set up a dashboard yourself. So now you're going to see this and they're going to be automatically sorted by most popular. What I want you to do is scroll until you see a dashboard called Audience Snapshot. It will give you a high level overview of who your website users are, which is a great way to get started figuring out who's coming to your website. So now what you want to do is click to import the dashboard and then in the next screen you can change the name of the dashboard if you want to but I think this is pretty descriptive so I'm going to leave it and I'm going to click create. And now you've got a more granular view of your website's audience for the past 30 days. That's the default by the way. You can always change that if you want. And then what you're going to see is uh, you're going to see unique visitors, you're going to see how many visits, a breakdown of new versus returning visitors, page views, bounce rate, all sorts of stuff. What I think is good is to see where your visitors are located geographically and Google Analytics makes it really easy to do. You just click visits by location and then you're going to see Okay, here the United States is by far the biggest demographic for this website. But the U.S. is a big country and I want to know where in the U.S. the visitors are coming from. So I click it, then you scroll down and you see, not too surprisingly, California is number one followed by Texas and New York. And so if you want to see where in California, you click that and then you can see Los Angeles, San Francisco, San Diego. It's just a really helpful way to start drilling down on the demographics of your website. Now check this out. If you want to, you can email this particular dashboard as a report to anybody you want to. You just click the email button, then you put in their name up here, their, their email address, and then here you can determine the frequency. They can get it every day, every week, every month, or every quarter. And you can also send it to yourself. It's a really good way to save time. Once you set up a dashboard, play around with it. Check out the different widgets. Customize them. It won't make you a Google Analytics expert overnight, but it might make you feel a little less overwhelmed.